All right, so we just came out and fed everybody, and they're all good. We had a few escape artists, our little uh, mixes right there. The Moran Easter Egg Mix, the, the little teeny black ones, they were out. They were getting out through a hole right there, so we patched that up with a brick, you know. Men. The lady's taking care of some light sprinkling. You know he didn't like that. There was an argument between Byron and Rocco this morning. Rocco was trying to, you know, do his thing with one of the brisees. Byron no like that. <laughs> and Byron just put in the call because there's some hawks out there flying around. Which made all the girls, most of the go girls who have age, they pew, they got out of here. And you may notice something new in addition to the flock. See that? We got two of those now. Polish hens. And again, that's Rocco. That's the one that we're going to be eating. We're going to be eating him uh, within a month or so. Mm -mm. Yum, 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 yum. But the new Polish girls, they're kind of shy. And we picked them up yesterday. They were, um, uh, 20, what was it, 15? They were $15 a piece. We just happened to walk into our tractor supply. And they had two of those ladies in there. And I said, give them to me. And back over to these little guys. They're fine, getting along, eating. And we have a few in there. That's relaxing. Everybody's doing good. Nice, healthy area. That's all. Just wanted to do a quick little update on what's going on. I have more videos coming soon. But... These little quick garden updates are my way of keeping in constant contact with you all and receiving feedback and a way to get small chunks of um, what's happening here out really quick without sitting down and doing a bunch of editing and, you know, all that good stuff. Because some things I feel don't deserve me sitting in front of the computer for hours on end scoring and editing a video. Oh, and one more thing. While I was at the tractor supply store yesterday, I picked something up. These. You know, it's like the end of July and they were having a sale on seedlings. So I picked this up right here. This was a buck. And of course I got one with two in it. So I'm going to go ahead and put this down uh, in one of those buckets pretty soon. Also, I got this one. Uh, pink brandy wine. There's three in there. So I'm going to get those down as well. Probably today. We'll see about it. This patty pan squash has had it. We're going to go ahead and pull that up and harvest the squash. This bucket too that just has grass growing in it. Another patty pan squash. This one has two in it. But the tree itself is uh, no more. And this one. We're going to harvest those two squash and plant in this bucket. So we do have a couple of uh, choices of how we're going to plant those plants. Also that one out there. That's an indeterminate tomato we're going to pull those last two off and if they're any good we'll eat them if they're not we'll give them to the chickens and we'll plant in that this is carrots we're going to pull those carrots plant in that and i don't know what type of tomato plant this is but it has carrots in it and it's it's odd because it has this one big one on there then it has these two little red cherries on there then it has this big one and that big one so i don't know what that is and it's not giving us enough fruit so i think we're going to go ahead and pull that off and plant new in there but that seems to be about it and that's what my job is today to make everything a little more comfortable and just a little more iry and as always man this is the father Theodore saying peace from the garden of Theodore one love <laughs>